Seattle. Yes. Absolutely. Tiffany 
follow instructions. Uh oh. You good to see you? Trouble holding that. I, I, you know, I can't hold this and paddle. Yeah, but they put up to switch hands. It sounds complicated. Oh, I got some rapids up here. Abby, hold on. Going fast. Uh oh, I'm drifting. Dude, hold on. Hold on. I'm glad I had a drifting. Can you sing us a Jamaican song? Watch where you're going. Watch where you're going. We're losing somebody. Okay. <laughs> no problem. Well, we got more rapids up here. I guess it's not very deep. Well, this is going to be fun. I'm drifting. How do you know it was me? Because you were right behind me. No, it's not. I'm over here with Abby. It's time for the rapid. Woo! Hold on tight. Yeah, yeah, get over there. Get off me. Abby? We're going to go now. <laughs> Abby? Oh, I'm stuck. Help, I'm stuck. Help, I'm stuck. It's not that kind of party. Hi, honey. Tiffany's out of her boat. 
Where is she? <laughs> She's out of her book. Why is Tiffany she out of her book? Where is she? She is the worst. What the hell? Ever. <laughs> what the hell is she doing? <laughs> Tiffany, get back in your boat. <laughs> Which one is this? Is this the second one or the, 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 this, is the first one. this is the first one? Yeah. The, the first step? Run ashore. Abby, what are you doing? Get getting her to what? Trying to run into me? I'm trying to go the wrong way on a one-way street. I want to go down those rapids again. Yeah. No, I'm just, we don't need to go back. Oh, the do, oh, the do-over button. Abby, are you having fun? That's where I ran aground, man, watch out. Going the wrong way, Chief. What was that? It's a solution. Oh. Oh. I heard something growling. What is that? I heard something growling over there. Tractors? Oh. Wow. Okay. Very cool. So we stuff like Tropicana in Florida. Life <laughs> of the orange that they use. Iceberg! Don't worry, I got you. Woo! Oh my gosh, that was cold. It's up to film and paddle at the same time, isn't it? Sure. <laughs> I didn't bring my helmet because I didn't think as I thought I was going to be in a, I, I was thinking about being in a tube. I wasn't thinking about paddling. Otherwise, I'd have brought my head strap. Sorry. 
We'll just have to go again after I get my head strap on. It's all right. She'll 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 screw up again, and we can catch her. That is a beehive. No, I have no idea. Hey, tour guide, what's this thing up here in this tree? It looks like mud. Termites. Very cool. Very cool. The circle of life. Is this bamboo right here in front of us too? Yeah, Wait, do I wait? It's Indian and Chinese. The right. Small one. That's the Chinese. Right. They told us the reasons that I'm. I'm trying to remember. Hold on. One of them was uh, the Chinese one was to feed the pandas, but the pandas never came. Well, the pandas came and some of them, well, they came and died. Oh, because it was tropical. Because it was too tropical. Yeah, right. And then the Indian came. Um, do you remember, Abby, why the Indian came? I don't. I don't. I don't remember. To make thirty foot rafts to bring sugar, rum, and right. molasses on the river from here back to Falmouth. Right. Yeah, man. I try to remember. They also planted by the banks of the river to prevent soil erosion. Okay. So today we use them to make a lot more than just rafts. For sure. She was wearing was made out of bamboo. Yeah, man. You there was... use it to make fish traps as well. You ever seen a bamboo fish trap before? I don't think so. When we reach further down, I'm going to take up one and show it to you. Thank That's you. That's what we use to fish from this river. Okay. Use it to catch shrimp, crawfish, and eels. There's... You got crawfish here? Yeah, man. Eels. You got crawfish all over the place in Texas. All over the place? All over the place. Well, the ones we have in this it's, river. It's practically a way of life in Texas. Way Craw of life. Crawfish. <laughs> yeah, man. It's a way of life here, too. For me, it takes too much work to eat. Too much? Too, I mean, because oh. it's a, a lot of work, and there's, just, and there's just a little bit of meat in it. <laughs> It up yeah. So yeah. You're the type like me, you know, I like to just take my food up and eat it. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. If somebody peels it for me, I'll eat it. Yeah. So I don't want to peel it myself. So, you know, you ever eat the crawfish with rice? Yes. Yeah, somebody has to Absolutely. What? Uh oh. Oh, I'm alright, I'm alright, I got it. I'm good, I got it. No, I got I got grounded. The water is nice and refreshing. I mean it was a little cold at first, nice and refreshing now. Right. Yes. They they mentioned that yes that's uh, that's I didn't I didn't know. I didn't know there was that I didn't know there was that many. Come on, twenty seven different varieties. So oh. the bananas they're not native to Jamaica either. They were brought here back in the day from. By Columbus. Yeah, we eat more green bananas around here than ripe bananas. Really? Why we eat green bananas? No. Because they're a good source of iron. Are they not? Iron's not in yellow bananas. So when it's green, there's no potassium, just iron. Yeah. And when it's yellow, <laughs> is that the case with all with all bananas in the world, or just these particular bananas? No, all bananas. All bananas. Oh. Ah, hey, what the hell? Hey. You boil them in salt water. Yeah, man. 
Like you would do yams or sweet potato or even Irish potato. What what is uh does that make it more nutritious? Well, or if you don't taste better? Boil it, it's gonna be too hard to eat. Oh the green the green been talking yeah. about the green bananas. Yeah, so you boil it and so we'll, we'll have to try that. We'll buy some green bananas and boil them in yeah, salt water. Boil them in, in salt water. water. In salt water. So when you boil them you have them with something sweet. So you know you can have it with like curry chicken. We have it with the national dish most times, Aki and codfish. Right. Yeah, we they talked they talked about that on the bus. So you could make dumplings, bananas, yams, Irish, pumpkin, you know, all the ground provision you could make. Abby, yeah, we gotta try that when we get home. I'm glad I got that all on, all on audio, so I'll remember it. <laughs> you know, right, bro? Okay. Upside down. Oh. Uh huh. Okay. Cooking oil. Okay. Okay. In salt. In salt water. Okay. Abby, we're totally trying that. So you see that yellow car down in down? The what? That car on the bank. Yes. What? Well, um. Uh. Right here. Oh yes, I see it. Thanks. A bamboo fish trap. Wow. Very cool. So the fish swim in there and get stuck. Yes, I do. Oh my gosh. The white stuff inside is coconut. That's what we use as bait for the trap. That is cool. That is really cool. Thanks for showing me that. Mom, you gotta make one of these. I'm gonna show my mom this. See if she can weave this. Yeah. The first part you make is the funnels. The funnels? Shrimp and crawfish. We have a little bit of shrimp inside. Is this water? Yeah, man. Oh, sorry, guys. Yeah, no, it's alright. That's over here. We're having a party? That is, that is really neat. So you're going to be delicious later. There's fresh water. Yeah. That is cool. They weave it. When they weave it, they make the funnel first. Uh -huh. Then you tie it. You have to weave, waffle the funnel together. So the first set of waffling you're going to do, as in the weaving, that's what we call the waffling. The weaving part, when you're making the funnel, you weave it up together with six holes, like six strips of bamboo. Okay. So when you weave it, like you're going to flat it on the ground first flat, then you're going to curl it around together. Okay. So you know what I mean by flat it, like you have one here, one here, one there, one right. there, one there. Right. So you put one here up. Then down, then, down, then yeah. up, then down. So you're gonna use tiny strips at first to do that part. Okay. So that part you're gonna eventually cut it off. Okay. So after you do it like that, you're gonna curl it around and it's gonna come together like a funnel. Right. So you pull them down to even them up, then you tie it together to hold it. Then you're gonna do some more down here. This is gonna be the first starting of the permanent one. Okay. So you're gonna do the permanent one from bottom all the way up to top. So while you're weaving it up, you're shaping the funnel as well. So you can make the funnel straight as an arrow, and it can, or it can be curved. So when you hold, when you make it curved, it, it catch more larger shrimp. Larger shrimp, sure. Larger, larger shrimp. That is really, I totally bet my mom, my mom weaves yeah. all kinds of things. I bet and she can make it. 
Yeah, I show these baskets and yeah, very cool. Are there bamboo seeds? How do you grow bamboo? Bamboo, you cut a piece of it and cut it out. Just like flowers, you cut a piece and you stick it in the dirt. That's how the bamboo grows. You know, you don't have to stick it in the dirt, right? When they commit suicide and fall down, once they get enough water, they start growing. They grow again. Yeah. Even if they stay in water, they are in water and there's no land around. They still start to grow. When, and when they commit suicide, does that mean that um, are they unusable after that point when they fall well, down? Or they're can not really unusable, but you know most people wouldn't want to use them. At that they time. want to get them before before they, fall. before they do that. So you can replant it at that time. Yeah. That's a plot. That one, if you read that, you have a CD tree. They call sour face. The candy they call sour face. That's what you would have if you eat that. <laughs> sour cream. So they smell good when they are ripe, but you know they still sour. Maybe, yeah. And then we can use the stuff outside. Um, and maybe your mom can like, leave with some of it, the fibers. Yeah. A gauche! A gauche! Something's happening. Abby, a gauche. Buffalo gal, won't you come out tonight? Come out tonight. Come out tonight. Buffalo gal, won't you come out tonight? Yeah. No, I'm not I'm not trying to control myself. Stuck!
deeper here. We stopped to look at shrimp traps. Where are you going? Stand there. Tiffany. I know. She is. She's, she's going to be the second to last. Yeah. Well, so those are going to be going to the other places? Oh. Oh. 